hi guys good morning and um yeah hi guys welcome back to my channel yeah so um today i'm just honestly i'm just so tired i'm just like this lagos is not for the faint-hearted like you go to work monday to friday yes there's work from home but you shall most of the time you're at work and this week has been so stressful like if you're in lagos you know that there's been like serious foil scarcity so you know going through all that stress and then when you come back like for the weekend as in uh, for the weekend for most of us is basically just saturdays because sundays you have to go to church and by the time church is over the day is kind of like almost gone so you just have the tail part of the afternoon to just rest and do what you need to do and for women as well most women you have to now you know some that's when some people take out time to you know cook lunch or if you didn't cook lunch on Sunday if you don't cook lunch on Sunday you cook it on Saturday so it's just very 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 stressful for me anything that would reduce the stress of this our Lagos I'm up for it I, I, I don't mind pain today's video anyways I am testing out online <laughs> market food shopping and I'm not talking about you know regular like foreign biscuits and foreign milk and all that no not grocery shopping I'm you know buying like market things tomato ugu achi or bono things that you know you need to carry your two legs and enter the market to get that you cannot get in a no so yeah I'm basically using someone called market on wheels she's i think she's quite popular here because a lot of people use her apparently um i just put together like market list i even added extra like things i'll, I'll, I'll get from the supermarket i said let me just try it out let me put it there let me see um if she can buy it too because you see things are hard if i can save money even like and they can get these things from the market you know why not because i know that they will sell some of these, these things I buy from the supermarket in the market. So, so far so good. What I did was I sent her my list and then she put prices of the things which, to be fair, I don't even know. It's higher than I expected but these days, the way the inflation is going, I don't know whether it's right or it's wrong. So, let's wait. Let's wait till we see. So, that gives me time to actually come and lie down and rest and sleep and just you know press my phone and do things like kick back because this week was very tough on me so for my proteins where did i get for my proteins i used i saw this page online meat underscore sharing underscore depot i got half a goods for seventeen thousand five hundred naira i'm still waiting for them to deliver it let me see what they pack then i told her that please can she give me live chicken big live chickens they will kill it and you know slaughter it and all that and she will give me that for four thousand naira each so yeah so i spent twenty five thousand on proteins and this is something that i think this will last me at least till i don't know but for a very long time a few moments later let me just um yeah you guys stuff are here so let me just go grab it i'll bring you guys along yeah so you guys i just got my stuff um i think this is the meat this is the meat because i don't think the market lady is ready so yeah let me show you guys what it looks like scam and i'm happy about that that the page is not a scam so see this is <laughs> this is basically what it looks like it seems very full so this is half a goat and two um old layers two old layer chicken live killed and clean down everything so yeah i'm going to bring it out but this is actually very heavy i can't get you out of my mind it's like i feel it for the first time been thinking about you all night I've been searching for this all my life You're just my type I've been looking for a boy who can treat me right Your dark hair with those eyes so bright They look into my soul and it sparks my life Can I take you? 
Yeah, so guys, I was able to get um, three bags of chicken. I packed them 10 10. So, yeah, I packed them 10 10. So, 30 pieces of chicken, and um, I have um, one for the goat meat. I have one, two, three, four, five. So, I have um, 30 pieces of chicken and 50 pieces of. <laughs> More than 50 actually because I just didn't want to be packing small small. So I have like 30, 30 pieces of chicken and 50 pieces of goat and you can you saw the size it was actually big so I'm not I'm actually happy about it. Hi guys so um yeah I've been out I went to visit a friend and while I was out my food stuff came I checked the time that went they came and the time they came was around 7 30 so yeah I went to pick them up let me just quickly show you what they are looking like before we go ahead and unbox what everything is i guess and yeah let me just you know show you what i did or what i brought basically two bags one very heavy two lighter three and then finally the fourth one four this is eggs all right, so let me just start. So the first thing I got was eggs, and these are the eggs. And she, I think one of these is broke. But yeah, this was two thousand four hundred. This is regular crates of eggs. So yeah, um, this is crayfish. So this is the crayfish I got. Like I'm not impressed because the crayfish I like is those ones that look golden brown and a fresh looking and this is not giving me any of that i'm not impressed with this at all like not at all i'm really not impressed with this crayfish at all this was five thousand naira for a painter so this is actually i'm not sure what how much it is but i think i'll put that on the screen um this is pepper for soup yellow pepper i think i think this was um 100 naira 100 naira pepper i asked her for dry fish and this is what she got and I think it's too, too small, in my opinion. She got catfish, like catfish, dry fish. For me, it's too small. And this supposed to be 600 naira, so... I don't know, like... They just... I don't know, it's not, it's not going... I know I, I would get better if I was to go by myself, so... Yeah, I got salt. So she got salt for me and um she got salt for 200 naira i asked for atarudo and i don't know why this is what they got for me like they got me tatashi i asked for at atarudo i got no cube for 800 naira this is iru i got a cup of iru i don't know how much that is i got a pinter of beans so I got a painter of beans. Let me see. Oh, One thousand naira uh, onions. These tomatoes. I like that they are very strong. Like I really like that they are strong. So this is a painter, a painter of tomatoes. I got a lot of vegetables. Five hundred naira vegetables. Five hundred naira stockfish. Not what I, not what I wanted. I wanted the one that is pieces without bone. Got a cabbage for 500 naira. So sweet potatoes, this is what she was able to get. 500 naira, this is what she's able to get. See the sweet potato, oh my god. This is actually a lot. A lot of sweet potato. This is a lot of sweet potato, really. Yeah, I was also able to get like color rose, rose color tissue. There are four kitchen towels. I was able to get four kitchen towels. Normally, I would actually buy this in the supermarket, but 
you know i'm able to get it at this price and i didn't have to go anywhere so i'm not i'm not mad at that so really i'm not i'm able to get chick morning fresh this is Yeah, so guys, I finished unpacking everything and um, I think there are a number of things that are missing. So let me just go, out, go and check. So what she did not get here right now is actually Agbalumo. I wrote for her to get me Agbalumo and um, I think she somehow managed to miss that out. But the plan was to cook today, but because of, you know, I, like I said, it came in around 7 o'clock. So I have to do it tomorrow, which is Sunday. So I guess maybe I'll postpone my cooking till next week. So I guess I would say that I should have made my order a lot earlier. Overall, in general, um, I think that it's a fair deal, you know, um, it's a good deal. I pay her for her time, but she didn't get exactly how I would want it to be gotten. And that's the thing with, if you want to do something, go and do it yourself. Example, the crayfish was not clean. The tatashi was not um the tatashi was supposed to be atarudo and i clearly wrote there atarudo i don't know why she bought tatashi the uh carrots were i don't like when carrots are stubby like this like what's this i like when they are long but for 200 naira this is not bad like this carrot this size of carrot i got is not bad the dry fish should have been bigger for the price 600 naira i feel like i would have gotten something bigger I like the tomatoes they were not bad onions were not bad i got good sized onions um sweet potatoes they were really a lot of sweet potatoes for the price um in which i paid um i like that i'm able to do this from the comfort comfort of my home i don't have to stress about going anywhere like she just sorted, sorted out everything for me and i could go about my day visit my friend you know live like a human being for one so i'm happy that I'm able, i was able to outsource that part but then the truth is that i feel like there are some things that should have she should have done better but i guess that is part of the expense of sending someone else and not going to the market so yeah again the green leaves i expected them to cut it but she didn't even ask whether i wanted it to be cut or not they just brought it like that so I'm going to cut it by myself, which will make my mother happy because my mother does not believe in cutting green in the market. I'll cut it by myself. So yeah, let me just unpack everything. All right, guys, let me just show you some of the things. Um, so this is the crayfish. Um, I've packed it up. So this is a whole painter of crayfish. So this is five thousand naira. Uh, this is the oh, this is the tomato. So you oh, that's it. That one there. So this is the tomato you can see how big it is so this is 2000 naira for a painter i think they really did well because see how red those tomatoes are um yeah this is the tatashe so this is tatashe she got for me it's like yeah, another bowl there's not much to do when all i can is thinking about you not doing well hi guys so today is a brand new day it's another day um i just wanted to come on here and end this vlog um hmm. so with my experience online shopping for like market items do i think it's worth my while will i do it again well the simple answer is yes i'll do it again because because of the stress there are things that I know that she definitely added some money on. There are things I know that I could have gotten cheaper. But then again, if I look at it, it is not entirely bad. So, given that, I think that I will buy with her again. Especially times where I am tired, like now, like this, like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm literally tired every day because of work so yeah i will ask i would continue to pay her to go to the market for me i'll continue to employ her services and um yeah i, I don't know so that's 
I would I would do that. It's just I feel it's comfort over um comfort over stress basically. Comfort pay for your comfort. That is what it is right now. You can't do it all in this Lagos. Like you actually you actually can't. Like for real, you can't. So yeah, that's yeah, I think um I would recommend online shopping. Can I can I just talk about the price of things in Nigeria right now? Like the prices have so skyrocketed that ten thousand doesn't seem like anything. Like it really doesn't seem like anything right now. Um I guess transportation fares have um has increased as well. So food stuff is literally very expensive right now compared to what it used to be before. So yeah, given that I understand that her prices are still high. I know that if I go by myself, I would get cheaper. But then I feel like it would work better for me if I had a very large household. So it wouldn't, the, the benefits, in fact, even if I go and shop in bulk from mile 12 by myself, the, 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 I can't guarantee that I will finish the stuff. I feel like they would just get stale in the freezer. Can things get stale in the freezer? No, but things can get stale in the freezer, but things will now start having that freezer taste. And I don't like to keep store things for a long time. So there's no need to actually, I don't think there's a need for me to start going to buy in bulk. But this period, I have to do what I have to do to help myself. So yeah, you guys. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope... Yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Anyways, I will definitely see you guys in my next one. And make sure that if you're not subscribed, make sure you are subscribed. I'll see you guys in my next one.